Hello everyone, this is Amit Dan of AmitDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of Google Assistant Tips and Tricks video and I'll talk about how to make a phone call using Google Assistant. So before you do that, you have to just uh, you know do a, see a few simple uh, settings change uh, which I'm going to show you first. So the first thing you're going to be doing is uh, go to Google Home which is right here and then you're at Google Home, you have to click on settings and then here you're going to see a few options and then one of them is going to be voice and video call which is right here so if you just click on it and here there's an option called mobile call uh, which is right here and so let's click on it and then here you're going to see that you know uh, set up your operator to make and receive voice calls and you have to just you know enter your number here you can see that uh, Google Assistant cannot receive calls on assistant devices so you can only make calls but you cannot receive calls so it's just like you know uh, the way it is uh, so uh, the device I have or any Google uh, you know assistant uh, or Google uh, smart speakers or smart devices you have uh, right now they can call uh, as far as I know uh, within uh, Canada, Mexico, US and UK. So I'm not sure if there are any other countries, but I think that's all the countries they have right now. So you can call in between uh, these countries uh, for free, uh, but you cannot take calls. So once you change your settings here, then the next thing you can do, if you'd like to you know, pull uh, the phone number just by calling the name, for example, call sister or call mother, then you have to just you know add uh, that person's name on your Google Assistant contact list, and you can add uh, to your contact list by going to Google Home. So you're going to click on the profile which is on the top right corner. Once you go to the profile, you're going to have to click on Google Account, which you're seeing right underneath the pen. And then once you go to Google Account, then you're going to be clicking People and Sharing. And here you can see that you know there's a contact right here. And then you have to just you know add that person or phone numbers to that contact. Uh, there's another easy way to uh, add phone number. You can just you know go to contacts.google.com on website, and you can add it that way too. That's much easier, I find. So usually whenever I need to add something, I just go to you know website Google. I'm sorry, contacts.google.com, and that way you know I can add it uh, at the same contacts instead of going through the app. So now you have everything set up. So let's say you want to call someone, you can just call, uh, ask Google Assistant to search for something and you know, Google Assistant can make a call. So for example, okay Google, call Domino's Pizza. You've got a couple of options. Which would you like? The first one. Calling Domino's Pizza. Okay, so you can see that, you know, it's started calling Domino's Pizza or you can just, you know, uh, tell Google Assistant uh, to call just by giving the number directly. Okay, Google, call 416-536-2371. Calling 416-536-2371. Welcome to ED Candidate Trust. During COVID-19, our branch is open with reduced hours for the health and safety of all. So you can see that, you know, you can call this way. So let's say you have added someone uh, to your contact list and you can just tell them to call uh, that entity and then, uh, you know, Google Assistant will be able to call that number. Okay, Google, call Visa Concierge. Calling Visa Concierge, Maine. Welcome to the Visa Infinite Concierge Service. For English, press 1. Pour le service en français, appuyez okay, sur le 2. Press 1. Thank you for calling the Visa Infinite. 
Okay, so you can see that you know, uh, whenever you're calling somewhere, and if uh, the system uh, needs you to press one, two, or like you know zero, then you can just tell the Google Assistant to uh, call that. Or if you have a touch display like this, then you can just also put that uh, on the uh, screen. You can touch it as well. So that's a very convenient way when you are making a call and you don't want to like you know touch anything. You can just tell verbally to press one or zero to get that extension or to get that uh, you know. Uh, something uh, to get that section whenever you're calling so that's another way of uh, you know to call so basically uh, it offers you to call freely uh, you know uh, to these countries i mentioned and then definitely if you want hands-free call uh, then uh, you know it's a very good option and uh, i spoke with uh, a few people on uh, uh, google assistant uh, and then you know everyone told me that you know the voice quality is very good and they had no problem hearing or no difficulty understanding so you know call quality and everything seems to be uh, pretty well so you can uh, definitely go ahead and use uh, you know google assistant as your uh, uh, to make calls and talk to someone so that's all for today thank you for watching this video forget about subscribing this channel forget about liking this video there will be more videos coming up so i'll see you shortly thank you